Good afternoon, everybody. Butch here at Winters Automotive and Trailer Sales. We're here today to talk about this 32-foot hall mark, all aluminum stacker. I'm going to show you a few of the features on this trailer. Beautiful trailer, lightweight being all aluminum, still all the convenience of the room you need to haul to your race cars or just collectibles. Start up here in the front, it has a big foot hydraulic jack. As you can see with the tongue, it's all tread plate, aluminum, really heavy duty, you can tell by the chains. As you're walking around this side, you're going to see it's equipped with a smart awning which actually tilts by itself if you get an enormous amount of rain. Uh, operates really nice, one finger touch control. Has the dual barn door type entryway. Gives you a lot of room to haul any of your uh, equipment in and out. We'll move to the back here a little bit. You're gonna see it's equipped with work lights outside, which are all gonna be LED quartz. Uh, a lot of lighting for you. Stereo system also outside. You can see it has dancing lights for the stereo to change color. You're going to be hauling it with tri axle. Not going to give you any problem. Nice smooth ride on the road. It's going to trail down the road really nice. Marker lights outside, electric 110, electric outside, air hookup on outside. And we're going to go to the back here real quick. Okay, and as we're entering in the back here, you're going to see the heavy duty aluminum ramp actually has a hold down to keep it in place so it doesn't move at all uh, but nice and sturdy unit back here as we walk up in you're going to see your transition strip it's going to make it nice and easy to come over this void area right here you're going to have access to your lighting switches in the back of the trailer also in the front of your trailer this conventionally stores your ramps that take you up on two uh, the lift itself here in the side and the saddle. You're going to see more air outlets here and more of the electrical outlets going down through the center. In the center back here, you're going to have where your batteries are stored, right under your lift section. All of your batteries are in here and they're all working in sequence together. As you look to the right, on the passenger side, we're going to have your cabinets for any kind of tool storage. So they're not an obstruction for getting in and out of the car, we mount them on this side here. As you look up into the front of the trailer, you're going to see more cabinetry up there. You're going to see access to the upper loft, which in most cases people mount their compressors, uh, whatever tooling that they need up there to keep out of the way. Your electric lift operates from the back here, has your safety levels, has your tie downs on it. Everything operates nice and smooth. Let's take a walk to the front. You have an access ladder, which takes you to the upper part of it. That way you can get up and down, even though you don't have anything stored, you're not getting out of the car up top. Once you lift your, your lift up, and you uh, get out of the vehicle up there, you can access the, the lower end from up top here. Coming down here, you have more air outlets, more uh, regular electrical outlets. This switch actually controls the electric upstairs. So you can shut that down here if you don't want any electric up there. Here's your radio, your inverter, your fuses, breakers, more outlets on this side. Up in here, you actually have your amp, you have a kill switch that kills all the power to the inside of this trailer if you want to shut her down for a couple days. More lighting, there is no shortage of lighting in this trailer. You have four different types of lighting in here, underneath, up top, entry lights, basically lights this thing up pretty bright at night time. Okay, and to finish up. You're going to see the rubber coin flooring, which is really nice to keep clean. Not very clean now. We've had a lot of traffic in the last couple days in here. In the center of the floor, you're going to have a cargo hold. Access to put a spare tire, straps, anything that you want to store in there out of the way. Other than that, let's take a walk to the back of the trailer again. On this side of the trailer, basically it's going to be straight, nice and clean. Not a lot of obstructions on this side. Still has a lot of marker lights, curb lights that actually 
let you see what's happening in the back of the trailer along the side of the road. Up here in the front, you're going to have your generator cabinet. Really nice size generator cabinet that you can store any type of fuels. Um, added accessories inside here. Uh, there again, like I mentioned, everything is up here in the front. This is your plug for your um, 50 amp service. This is the operation key to do your big foot jack. And walking back around to the front again. Has a nice aluminum slide in step, which conveniently goes out of the way. And to the back, I'm going to open up the, I'm going to close this door so you can see the latch system on these doors. Very secure system. You can see how easily the door operates. This is going to be your latch system. It's also a, a lock area, nice, secure, tight. If you're looking up top, you also see a few floodlights up there. It has lighting that comes down on your ramp as you're entering. Like I mentioned earlier, this has no shortage of lighting. So there it is. This is your 32 foot Hallmark all aluminum stacker. Stop in and see it for special pricing. This week we have special pricing on all of our trailers here, but especially this one here. We need to move this one out. We've got a few more coming. Stop in and see us. Thank you.